Welcome back, everybody. Just doing a couple odds and ends around base. Putting all my uh, materials away and making sure there's enough berries and food for everybody and everybody's nice and safe and comfortable. I've been thinking. I need a saber cat. I'm going to need a tame that will go with me into some caves and protect me from all the bad things inside. And I'm going to need something that will fit through the, the bars on my taming traps so I can go get other tames. And a saber cat just seems like it's going to be the way to go. So let's uh, get some stuff together, head to a mountain, and see what we can find. All right, I think we're ready. Uh, the sun is fully out. I've made up some stuff. Um, let me grab a little more food. The rest of this in the feeding trough. Let's see. All right, so that's in there. So I made up some. Actually, I need to make up a couple more bolas because there was some activity while I was uh, making all this stuff up. I needed to use a few bolas. Let me show you what happened. While I waited for night to end, I decided to run and grab some drops. There was a blue one and a green one across the water. The blue one was closer, so I decided to hit it first. It's dark, so I put my torch on. When I got to the blue drop, it was guarded by piranhas. I had to take care of them. They wanted them to make short work of them. Once I got rid of them, I jumped off and checked the drop. Battle for Romanta. I may or may not use that later. Time to head to the green drop. Nothing guarding this one, so it was easy to pick it. Some farm stuff, though. There was a blue drop coming down. I waited for it to get all the way down, then jumped off and checked it out. Hot spot. Of course. way back to base. As I got closer, I noticed there was a green drop across the water the other direction. I decided to cross the river and grab it. More farm stuff. After unloading everything back at base, I noticed there was a bird haunting my front yard. Gotta take care of that guy. Spotted this tech parasaur also walking around out in front of my house. It's purple and green. I think I'll have to tame it. Crafted up a couple of bolas. I'm gonna bolo it and knock it out. Just level 50, it only took two shots to the face. Keep him safe now. Uh, of course the Pego spotted me. Tough little bugger. I'll take that water skin back. Oh, 
that Dillo's too close to my team. Gotta go. One more bite ought to do it. There he is. Purple and green, pretty cool. We'll put him in a soul ball and store him in a box for now. And there you go. It's not much excitement, but a little bit of excitement. Okay, so I've got 10 bolas. I've got small drop trap I'm going to use. Um, I've got 58 trank arrows, which it should not take 58 trank arrows. But I have some extras because my aim is terrible. All right. Let's go. Um, yeah, where do I want to go? Yeah, so I think where I want to go is it's gonna be that mountain up in the top right corner um there's a giga spawn there so it might not be a good thing but you know what let me grab the canoe oh that reminds me i figured out what was happening with my ingrams um it was it's part of s plus that allows you to unlock um all the ingrams no matter what map you're on so I fixed that in the I&I, &I, and now my Ingrams are properly locked. The canoe is still unlocked because I haven't done a mind wipe. But once I do that, I will, um, I will lose access to the canoe on the island. But until then, I'm going to make use of the canoe while I have it. Alright, I will see you at the mountain. Ooh, what do we have here? He's a pretty blue. She's a pretty blue. Oh, that'd be a good mate pair for our the male that we just tamed back at base. Two shots. I think we'll throw some berries in this guy and just let it uh, just let it sit for now. We'll come back for it once it's tamed up. See if we can get this Pelagornis. Yeah, shouldn't take more than a couple shots. I'm gonna have to get some fish meat though. Is it with two shots? Nothing around to, to eat it. Alright, let's get some fish. One purple one. There we go. Oh my goodness. There would be plenty. Sit here and tame up. Or we get the other one on the tracker. Oh, the other one's tamed already. I'll like put this guy on the tracker. And go over and get that other one. Crack it. Look at this guy throwing in a ball. Carry him back over there. Take these berries with us. Grab some narco berries while I got this guy over here. I think I'm gonna need to 
pop off the topor on the uh the Gornis. The three times taming is is nice because you don't have to use narcotic a lot on them on the various things, but some of them with the faster torpor rates you gotta you still need to use a narcotic or or berries if they have a really fast torpor drain. been so long since I've tamed up. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. You ate my Pelagornis. Nice. Vengeance. Oh, that was. Jeez. That had to be done. You ate my Pelagornis. Look at you. Look at you. You know what, though? Couldn't even give me some raw prime, huh? pair that's to attract that Perfect was that. Alright, I'll fight you. I'm gonna leave this guy here. Um, I think he's pretty safe on this rock. I'm gonna continue my journey and I'll grab it on the way back. Also, one of the benefits of playing on a server is that um, everything should go into stasis while I'm not near it. So, so with nothing rendered over there, it should be fine. Fingers crossed. We're coming up on the mountain now. There's usually there's usually all kinds of Apex predators around here. There's saber cats, uh, rexes. There's a giga spawn here. You don't have the argents that spawn around here. Ah, can't climb rocks. I think I'm gonna get any of these notes right now. I'll save them for a, a dino I need to level. And, ooh, that is a bunch of raptors. Let's see here. Back away slowly. I guess if I don't find anything here, I could always go over to um, Carno Island. See what I can see over there. I'm just not finding anything. Pretty much gone around the mountain at this point. Oh, 
There's one. What level are you? Great. It doesn't have to be a super high level. Just uh, nothing under 50, though. All right, I think the move's gonna be to go to Carno Island and see what's there. All right, let's get on the water. Get across there. Get this guy in a ball. I don't want to leave him on the beach. Of course, it has to be foggy. It's always foggy on the island. Alright, let's see if we can get this trap laid out. Get close enough to the beach there. Is this guy placed? I don't want it to be underwater. Like that. I wanted to be just above the water. There we go, perfect. The other one's down. Have a little more flexibility because it's probably technically floating. S plus lets that happen. Ramps. All right, beautiful. Let's back the canoe off a little bit. There we go. All right, let's see if we can do this without getting killed. There is a level 70 something, but I want to get this level 30 in the trap first. Throw some meat in this. I'm gonna tame it. Um, I don't know if it's worth it, but it's something. There's that level 72. Oh, the level 72 is a male as well. Okay. Here's what we'll do. It's fast. Yes! Ha! Alright, so it's important to get headshots on this one. I don't want to kill it. This is going to be really close. And that's about it. There it is. Oh, 
God. The 180. Alright, I'm gonna just sit here and babysit this while it, uh, while it tames. You put it on the tracker. Keep an eye on it. Alright, we'll come back when it's tamed. Alrighty, there we go. That took forever. Uh, not really, but it felt like forever. You are ready to come out of there, aren't you? I had to get naked because it was really, really hot. I put you right in the... I didn't just sold all. Uh, cook. Go this way. All right. Now we're gonna cross the water. And go get our um, get our other iguana done. And we'll head back to base and we'll look at them all. Get saddles and all that good stuff. Oh boy. Come on. I didn't think anything was gonna aggro on me like this. You cannot see me. Oh boy. And there's nothing. Oh, come on. Run, run, run. Look, if you don't look, they won't see you. Well, that was exciting. Oh boy. Alright, let's get this iguana done out. We need a little more mobility. Canoe. I want to go back for it. See if we can drag them somewhere. Oh, there you are. Go eat something. That's not me. Eat this compy. All right. There's the sarco. Where's the alpha raptor? me All right 
Sarko seems to be busy somewhere. Raptors nowhere to be seen. All right, let's give this a shot. Get out of here. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Okay. There's that guy. We'll fight that turtle or something. Leave me alone. Oh, hey, there you go. Oh, you're done already? Yeah. It's just, you're just lucky I have to go get my other iguanodon or else. Yeah. Good Lord. Let's go. No more surprises. soul ball and take him home what did you get that was 245 yeah cool I'll we'll probably breed it back with the uh, with the one we have at base and actually I want to have my pocket and see if we can get the best stats out of the both of them All right, let's get this canoe turned around. Point it back toward base. There we go. All right. Let's see what we got. Let's start with the saber cat. Not the worst. We got a 21 points in health, 26 in, in stamina, 27 points in weight, 28 in melee. So I guess it's just kind of average. Let's throw it out. You are very, a very average saber cat. Okay, this guy I'm excited about. Mm, this one right here. So, we got 39 points in the health. Nice. 34 in stamina, doesn't really matter. 43 in weight. That's awesome. 26 in melee doesn't really matter. Because, I'm not going to use them to fight. I'm going to use them to run. Look at you. And throw out your girlfriend. There you go. They're in love. They're very similar. So let's, um. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Immediately, let's get an egg. And there we go. Right. Table 
mating. Disable mating. You see the it's going to be ready to mate in 12 minutes. I've got the um, taming and maturation and all that turned up, down. It's shorter. It's shorter. All of it's shorter. And let's see. Too cold here, so we'll need some uh, need some fire. If one campfire is going to be enough. Yes, it is. I'm going to let it get down to about a second, and then I'm going to pick it up. Almost there. Pick it up. All right. Actually... Go ahead and throw it out and see what stats it has. I will cryo, whatever you want to call it, soul ball it. It's a boy. Oh. Well, it got the weight. Don't, um, don't look. Oh, calm down. Didn't see that. No one saw that. All right, let's see. We got our, our male moose chops. Go in here with our... All right, I feel like we uh, made some good progress today. We got our cat here. He's gonna help us get some other tames. And um, he's gonna gather some hide and, and whatnot for us. And uh, but that's gonna wrap it up for today. Uh, thanks for watching. And until next time, take it easy.